Today is not the day to leave your pets in the car while you run errands. In fact, at least two people did that in Williamsburg and Animal Control took their dogs away. 13 News Now reporter Nico Clemens is live with details. And Nico, one incident happened at the visitor center. Yeah, one in the visitor center parking lot, the other right here in another parking lot, which is about five minutes away. You guys, the heat index, as you all have mentioned, has reached triple di digits almost every day this week. So you can only imagine how hot it gets inside of a car and leaving an animal inside can be dangerous. Two dogs left inside two separate cars. Both owners nowhere to be found. Both calls came earlier this week at the start of this massive heat wave. I've seen it before, but sometimes it's with an air conditioned car, but I mean, that's not very safe. James City County Animal Control eventually came and took the dogs. That's terrible, sad news that people would leave their dog. That's no different than a child. Melissa Junk has had her dog almost a year. She knows how dangerous it can be leaving pets inside of a hot car. They have fur coats, so they get hotter than a typical human being in a hot car, then they need to be hydrated and taken care of like a child would. James City County Police say it's a very serious problem. With the extreme heat we've had this week, it only takes a matter of minutes for the temperature inside of a car to rise. There could be tragic consequences even for a pet. Police say leaving windows cracked, even the AC on, is not the answer. They say leaving a dog inside a hot car is the same as leaving a child in a hot car. The idea behind a child, they're not able to care for themselves and open the vehicle, open the windows, get out. Uh, when they start to experience discomfort and have problems, the same thing applies to a pet. Jung says it's not even a second thought. If she gets out the car, her dog's coming with her. They're basically like a child and they should be cared for like one. So I don't think it'd be any different. And both owners picked up their dog at the shelter. Both received summons for inadequate care. Live in Williamsburg, I'm Nico Clemens, 13 News Now. You saw their law enforcement take these cases seriously. Dogs can easily die if they're left in a car on a day like this. Temperatures can skyrocket quickly in a hot car. If it's close to 95 degrees like today, the temperature can climb to 130 in just 30 minutes.